This video is going to show you how to use the SwissWeb Maya plugin. First, you need to load an image from your local device. You will see the counter detection result after the image is loaded. You can change the threshold and use eraser to get a better result if you want. Now you can do the SwissWeb 3D modeling by drawing three strokes. The first and two strokes are used to define the profile shape like circle or square. And the third one is going to define the object orientation. After the three strokes, you can see the 3D modelings. We also support the functionality resampling the control curves on the object. You can use the slider bar or text field to do this. You can also use control curves to optimize your result. For example, you can scale one of your control curves to make the result better. Finally, you can use the finalize button to get your final object. Here is some other example. In the counter detection part, you can also use draw mode to add your own counters. Also, draw three strokes to do the 3D modeling. The object will be shown in the perspective view, which is computed by the angle between camera and the profile shape. We also support 3D modeling for rectangular or cuboid shapes. Profile shapes would be checked automatically by the angles between the first and second strokes. Here is another example for the complex object. We support interpart optimization by aligning the closed parts with normal or origin or both. You can adjust the corresponding threshold manually in the UI toolbox. Then draw three strokes for each part one by one. Our authoring tool shows robustness facing with curved shapes. After some small adjustment and combination, we get our final result. Thank you for watching.